Hello guys, today we are going to talk about the Beho magnetic sensor known as KY035. This is the module itself. So, let's get started. Today's video is brought to you by ORGVSM, an online store where you can find shirts, jeans and cool accessories that fit your needs. All the products are made in Italy. They can be shipped worldwide. So don't waste your time, start looking fancy today with their style. For more information go to orgvsmshop.net or check it out at the link on the video description. As you can see this module has only the Behor magnetic sensor and nothing else. So let's continue with our video. Now I will show how these components are connected together. There we have the sensor itself. On the right you can see how the pins of the module are connected on this board. So we have in red the flow of the voltage, we have in black the flow of the ground and of course we have in green the flow of the signal. All that this sensor does is to detect the magnetic field. Since this module has only the magnetic sensor on board and no LEDs that help visually to see if the magnetic field has been detected, we can actually program by ourselves. Other thing that we can do in order to see if any magnetic field has been detected by the sensor is to open our PC or we can connect any LCD to our board. Let's talk about the pins. The pins in this module are three. We have the ground pin with a minus sign. The voltage pin is in the middle. And of course we have the pin of the signal with the S sign. So let's talk about the signal. This module gives an analog signal so we can connect the pin of the signal with any analog port of different microcontroller boards like Arduino or Raspberry Pi. That's it guys for today, if you like the video hit that like button, if you want more videos like this one hit the subscribe button with the bell icon so you'll be notified for every video, we upload new videos every day so the only chance to see them first is of course through subscription, don't forget to check our social media and see you guys next time.